Madrid, Madrid, Madrid. How many times will Brian call you? Over 1.5, over 2.5, over 3.5. How many times will you fail, Vincent? Right, uh, it was another tough weekend for the gamblers. And trust me, we need to get another strategy, but we still continue <laughs> uh, doing double your <coughs> money over the weekend to the Liquid Sports Show. Yeah. Uh, I go by the name Vincent. And I go by the name Brian. What and, happened? Uh, what happened? Uh, we promised that something special was going to happen. And unfortunately, the something special was all of our bed slips. Uh, in Swahili, they say, kukunyo amaji. Yes. <laughs> they drank water. <laughs> yeah, that was tough. So it was tough. Mm, been losing actually Atletico Madrid, you know. These Madrid teams, I think I, I'm going to refrain from them. Do you and, have Madrid um, in your team? In your no, bed not at all. I, even La Liga, I don't think I'll, I'll, I'm going to bet on the league again. I almost thought that um, maybe I should put some money on Barcelona, but um, I, 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 my instincts tell me that La Liga is not a good zone right now. So, yeah, but we have to try again this strategy to see if it's going to work again. Yeah. And, um, yeah, that is why we always say that you should stake the match that you can lose. Yeah, right. stake what you can afford to yeah. lose. So that it's easy for you even when you lose, you accept it. Yeah, I accepted when Madrid failed me and... Uh, Actually, I thought they're going to win. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, before you placed on Atletico, I remember I told you, you I told don't me. trust that team. And, and you know because what? the team which plays... Uh, mm. Let me say rubbish football yeah. at the back. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, there, there's something funny that happened in that game as well. Yeah. Uh, at first half, the game was nil-nil. Yeah. And then at around 60th minute, um, Atletico Madrid player scored. Is it Correa or someone? Uh -huh. And then... Uh, the goal was ruled out by VAR and then he was substituted off. And then when they reviewed the goal, it happened that the goal would stand. So he celebrated from the bench. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. But then again, uh, Getafe managed to score a penalty and uh, that is how I lost that bet. But it's okay. This time, we do. We go again, never giving up, man. Yeah, what do you think? winners never quit, yeah, of course, and yeah. we need to keep on pushing. Yeah. So we try once again. You double your stack over the weekend, yeah. and we see how things go. Mm -hmm. I'm positive we're gonna win both Saturday and, and Sunday. Sunday, especially for me. Ha. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm confident uh, something gonna happen. Mm -hmm. Um, so I start. I do Saturday. You do. S Saturday too. Yep. Then you do Sunday. I conclude Sunday. Let's go. Right. Two teams mm -hmm. and uh, two point two six odds. I'm very keen because I'll. <laughs> Last time I remember was uh, Rock edited my sleep and gave you my winnings. It's How? okay. I don't know if it was Never. Rock or Simon. Never. They, they, they always they edit my bed sleep they, they so that I lose, so that I, I give you money. So. They reduced your teams to a point like uh, still, but you still lost anyway. So mm. on Saturday, I have two teams in the Bundesliga, mm. uh, the Germany League. Mm. I have Mainz. People Mines. people will call it Mainz, but it's called Mainz. Yeah, it depends with where you come from, though. So. It doesn't depend where you come from. There's a name. You yeah. need to pronounce it correctly. <laughs> then uh, taking on Augsburg, <coughs> that's over 2.5. Mm. Uh, then Salzburg, taking on Austria, list now, mm -hmm. uh, also over 2.5. Mm -hmm. Simple as that. Yeah. How many odds are those? 2.26, depends. Could be mm -hmm. high, could be low, depending on the bookmaker you're using. Okay, so my Saturday goes like this. I'm coming back to the EPL and I have the league leaders taking on Brentford. I think the league leaders will bounce back and they will score at least two goals and Brentford might get one. So I'm going for over 2.5 goals. And then I also have AS Monaco versus um, Paris Saint-Germain, PSG. I have also over 2.5. So that's a total of 2.7 <coughs> depending on the bookmaker that you're using. So those are m that is my Saturday bet slip that I think. Right, we go um, quick to Sunday. Uh -huh. What do you have on Sunday? Uh, on Sunday, I have Premier League teams as well. Two I really fear Premier League teams. <laughs> I remember on over the weekend, Arsenal could not score a goal. Now, let me tell you something. Yes. If you see me placing a bet on a Premier League team, I'm confident. I'm 
a hundred percent confident. So okay. I'm going for uh, the Rose Derby, Leeds United versus Manchester United. Manchester United win. They are away from home. Possible. Yes. Yeah. Possible. And then I have uh, Manchester City versus Aston Villa over 1.5 goals. Good. Two bet. Manchester team. <coughs> We'll do something this weekend. So I'm confident and I'm going to stake high on this one. Right. I, I have uh, one of the best teams uh, playing free scoring football. Mm -hmm. Talking about Napoli uh -huh. taking on Cremonians. Uh -huh. That is over 2.5 uh, uh -huh. for Sunday. Mm. Then, uh, like I said, Switzerland League is back mm. and I have young boys taking on St. Gallen. Yeah, I think you, you are taking advantage of young boys as well because they drew 1-1 one, one last time. So yeah. this one, they might drop a, a lot of goals. Yes, so they love to attack. Mm, and I I'm think your bet slip looks good as well. So yeah. I, w I had decided... I that have interest in your Sunday bet slip, actually. I'll monitor it. Yes. Win for Manchester of 1.5. For Manchester City. City. And for yeah. you, I think I'm going to go hard on your bet slip as well because i i kind of feel like you stole my bet slips before i chose those teams but <laughs> well in so we are feeling very confident we wish you the best of luck as you tried if you placed our previous bet slips and you lost let us know in our comment section of this video or our facebook page at liquid sports show we will be able to compensate and see what we can do for you yeah sure i think that's all from us always i tell people and sure you can go for a break if things go tough. Sometimes yeah. betting can be uh, tough yeah. and uh, you see you need to control yourself. Yeah. At this time of the season, mm -hmm. probably it has been tough. Of January and Feb, which is really tricky. Yeah. Because uh, when you look at previous seasons, uh, leagues are tough uh, around May, yeah. around, I mean, March, April, because teams are trying to avoid going for relegation. So, yeah, yeah. hence... So be keen and uh, always wishing you the best of luck. Yeah, for us, I think we have been in this uh, betting like for Industry a number for of years. Longest, yeah. So we are used to losing. <laughs> but when we win, we win huge. Yeah. And we will bring you our winnings very soon. So we've come to the end of our bet sleep section. My name is Brian. They call me Vincent. And uh, this, this is, is the Liquid, Liquid Sports, Sports Show. Show.